Good morning! We are getting ready to head to Helen, Georgia this morning, and you're coming with us. Let's get ready. I'm Bill. I'm Kelly. And this is our and This is our adventures. Oh! Here we go. It is a lot of work to do when I'm headed out of town, whether we're camping or staying in a room. I want everything cleaned up. I want the bed made. I want all the dishes washed. We carry out the garbage. So when we come home, oh, and I make sure all the clothes are washed so that when we come home, there's not already a mess here for us. It's just the mess of us coming back because usually you got clothes to wash and everything. I'm trying to downsize, but oh, it's so hard staying in a room versus staying in a camper. Cause like, I keep thinking, oh, I might need to take that. 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 Oh, and I might need to take that. So we have a lot of, I, I mights, but I only have my clothes in one bag, which is really good. And then we've got a dog bag, we've got a snack bag, we have our camera bags, and then we have like a towel and bathing suit bag and Bill's bag. Ooh, it's a lot of bags. All right, got lots to do. Let's get going. And my dining room does have boxes stacked in it because uh, I was trying to put all my fall decor out before we left. Not good. I stage everything here on the counter. That way, anytime I find or see something that I know I want to take, I go and just drop it there. Then I find a place for it. Another thing that I'm going to be utilizing while I'm gone this time is it's called smart plugs or adapters. You put them in your plugs that you already have. And then from your phone, you can click one button and I can turn all my lights, all my lamps or anything that plugs in off. Or back on. So we're going to utilize this. This will be the first time we've had this since we've started traveling. And that way I can turn the lights on and off when I want to make it look like someone's home. Hey, babe. Mm -hmm. When do you pack? Right before we leave. What the hell else are you supposed to pack? Oh, are you not supposed to be like me? How far in advance do I pack? You were packing two months ago. Yeah. All right, get to blow my hair dry. <laughs> Piled up the blankets back here for the puppy dog so they can lay in the back. Not, Belle will not, she hates it. Aspen, we'll get back here. Belle hates it, she has to be touching you. That's why I have to wear leggings on travel days because they tear up my legs. Or Belle tears up my legs. Are you ready, Vitville? All right. Where we're staying at is Bear Creek, and check in is at 3. She said that we might get check in a little bit early, but we don't know yet. So, we're gonna stop and eat just outside Gainesville, Georgia. It's called Dar Spot, it's supposed to be like a little hole in the wall, and they have picnic tables and stuff that we can sit at with the dogs. So, we're gonna go and stop there and have a bite to eat to kill a little bit of time. Uh, 
It looks a little busy, doesn't it? So this area is a common area. It's available to people in all the cabins. Um, so there's fire pits here. There's also a fire pit right next to where um, you're going to park for the cozy cottage. So that we have our tubes and then there's the tubing companies. Okay. So there's the two ways to go tubing. Um, you can walk to the tube where the buses come in. It's called River Tubing. And the bus will take you to the upper pay point and then you pay for their tubes. And then you can tube the whole river. It's like two, two and a half hour tube ride. The bus can bring you back here. You can walk to your cabin. And we have our tubes and with our tubes, what a lot of guests do, they'll usually do both, but they'll walk to toward the dead end street. And there's a stake on the right hand side and it's wrapped in red tape. And there's a little path. It's like a two minute walk carrying the tube and it's like 20 minute tube back. So a lot of people will do that just to like cool off. And sometimes people have kids. Yeah. And the kids want to keep tubing, and the parents <laughs> want to sit there and drink beer, and it's safe enough that the kids can walk down, and yeah, they awesome. make loops. That's where we're going. Okay. We have bears. Um, they could care less about us, but they do care about um, <laughs> trash. Okay. So, especially since you guys have a little walk, don't even take it out of the cabin and put it on the porch. Because if you put it on the porch and you're like, oh, I'll bring it down in an hour or so. They'll smell it. They'll smell it and they'll tear it apart and then you'll um, in the river in the riverfront area. So um, right here where this bird house is, there's a path um, steps that go down and a path that lights up at night, just like this path light, lights up at night to get down to that riverfront area. Okay. So these are all our cabins. We have um, nine cabins on nine acres. Um, so there's two down by the riverfront, and then coming all the way up this town valley, you have two more on that next level above us. But there's a hot tub right out here that we yeah. just added. They yeah. added the porch. She's gone. Then, <laughs> it's water. It's water. So it's fine for them to drink it, bathe in it, whatever they'd like. That's so yeah, cute. yeah. A bunch of people, and you're one of the. <laughs> it's just little, but we can all fit. Yeah. This is cute. Yeah. There's a little doggy, like, bully thing, which you may have even brought, brought your own. We did, because I didn't know. AC's there. Yeah, look and that little coffee maker that you probably saw, the yep. carry. Wow. This is, like, the coolest little cabin in the woods with a creek running down beside of it. How awesome is that? <laughs> I wish I had the camera going before she stepped off. I don't think it got it in time. <laughs> good. Does that feel good?
right, we are all settled here in Helen, Georgia. Tomorrow we're gonna go do a little hike and then we may take the dogs go tubing down the river because they've got a place here where you can walk up just a little bit. And she said it's about a 20 minute ride back and you can just go back and forth and it's free. And um, you can use their tubes. So I think that's what we're gonna do tomorrow. We're going to run down here and eat at Big Daddy's. You've been there before, so I'm not taking you. And we'll see you in your next video. Thanks to everybody that has subscribed. And please like, subscribe, and hit the bell notification so you can watch more fun adventure videos.